Previously on, my demon best friend. Jerry, you are a leech of a friend. I will seize control of the entire overworld, all made possible through the simple manipulation of the dumbest, most gullible human being to ever exist. Hello, Jerry. I'm your new best friend. Your demon. You summoned me all the way from the twelfth plane of reality. So you're my new best friend? And you're a demon? Like Satan? Well, Sir Satan is my overlord. I serve him. He's a good man, quite the philanthropist. I'm just a normal demon. And you're a new best friend. Come. Sit. thought you'd look more demonic. Well, every demon pretty much looks exactly like I do. Why should I believe anything you say? Here, have some coffee. My name is Ballas. You summoned me to be your best friend. And so, I I'm hereby linked to you for all of eternity. Where you go, I go. If our tether extends more than five kilometers, I will die slowly and painfully as I am crushed into a single atom that you may keep as a souvenir if you so desire. As long as I am alive, I will care for you whenever you need me. And I will be there for you. Always. Please. Sign you. Jerry, you need this. You need a friend. Let me help you. You seem different, Goose. Take my advice. Uh, if you're asking if I got a pee rig, no, I didn't. Yeah, I saw you could have used one yesterday, that thing on the news, the recent blunder. Well, I've been doing better since then. I have acquired the coats. Ice cream is for civilians, Goose. If you want to keep this job, you got to take it more seriously. What the hell? What the hell? You have spoiled my best friend's snack. For that, he may now eat you as his snack. Jerry, start with the fingers. Oh, please. Holy hell, Ballas! Hell is not holy. It is a dark abyss where all happiness goes to die. Including yours. Go on, Jerry. I can tell you're ravenous. Do you want me to summon my blade? No, I don't! Put him down! What? I think my beer is full. He has destroyed your meal. You have every right to quench your hunger with his bones. Well, that's right. I don't want to exercise. Please. 
Put him down. <coughs> Jerry, what's wrong with your friend, dude? He's got dumb uh, ES disease. Dumb ES disease? I think I had a cousin with that. Yeah, so then you know how dangerous it can be. I should probably get him home. You can cover for me, right? Yeah, sure. Jerry, did I do something wrong? Yeah, you did. You tried to get me to eat my coworker. What happened? I'm sorry, it's just... I've never been in your run before. Where I'm from, the inferno burns in everyone's hearts. Hatred is the way of life. If you even feel an ounce of love, you will be instantly devoured. Instantly. My wife made the fatal mistake of loving me. Now, she is nothing but a memory that I have long forgotten. Well, if you can't love anyone, then what's the deal with this whole best friend thing? Oh, well, that's the one exception, of course. A demon may find a human he wishes to befriend and become tethered to him, as I've done to you. But I'm the one that summoned you. Oh, well, that's the other one exception, of course. Okay, well, if we're gonna do this whole tether thing, then we have to establish some ground rules. Okay. Rule number one, can't hurt other people. Jerry, I would never think of doing such a thing. Rule number two, you're human now. You have to blend in. Humans don't have horns. Well, I, I don't know about that. Rule number three, it's the most important one. We're not just best friends, we're best friends forever. I mean, I know we're tethered and all, but still, we have to look out for one another. Agreed? Agreed. You know, speaking of the tether, there's actually a way to remove it for, you know, convenience. <laughs> Jesus, there are so many rules of this thing. Only you have the power to remove the tether, and by doing so, you would grant me the rest of my abilities. You have abilities? Oh, yes, sorry, um, I forgot to tell you. Currently, I have super strength, I can summon mundane objects, and I can possess willing subjects. That's so cool. But if you were to release me, all of my power would be at your disposal. Yeah, I don't know about that. What? I think we should stick with the whole tether thing for now. In time. <laughs> okay, Ballas. Do you see that girl over there? That's Aubrey. Is this a test? Do you want me to blend in? You said you can possess people, right? Willing subjects, yes. I'd like to ask her out on a date. I wish to pursue her romantically. Jerry, you dog. I'd ask her myself. I just don't have the stones. What do you need stones for? To throw it to her? Is this some kind of human courting ritual? No, I don't have the, the balls. Oh, you're female? No, metaphorically, I don't have the balls. Oh, you are a coward. Yes, I'm a coward. Look, last time I talked to her, I peed my pants. What I'm saying is, can, can you just help me or not? What's a friend's for? Hello, Aubrey. Just got off of work. How you doing? Hey, Jerry. I'm good. Just got off work myself. Sorry I peed my pants our last encounter. It's okay, I thought it was kinda cute. <laughs> well, I'm a cute guy. Speaking of which, you're a cute girl. We should begin courtship, now. You know what? Sure, sounds nice. How's tomorrow at five? Text you the deets, baby. Wow, you're forward, I like that. Well, I gotta go. Work thing. I thought you said you just got off. I only get off on you, baby. Nah, I got a second job now. 
business related. I'm rich, by the way. How was that? Demon best friend and I together 